Welcome back to another video on the China Mathematical Olympiad 2020. If you have not checked out the previous video on problem 1, I will strongly encourage you to do so and I have put a link in the description below. In this video, we will take a look at problem 4 which is a geometry problem. So for this problem, we have an acute triangle ABC with length AB bigger than AC and the triangle has circumcenter O. M is the midpoint of the minor arc BC and AK is the diameter. So the line parallel to AM that passes through O meets AB at D and meets CA extended at E. The lines BM and CK meet at P while lines BK and CM meet at Q. So we are supposed to prove that OPB plus OEB is equal to OQC plus ODC. So for this problem, the first thing we will do is we will reflect the points K, P and Q across OM. So specifically the way I'll do it is I'll reflect K across uh, the, the line OM to the point K prime and then B K prime and C M intersect at P prime and B M and C K prime intersect at Q prime. And for the first step I'll be proving that B O D and B P prime C are similar triangles. This can be done with a bit of angle chasing. So let's take a look at uh, the rate angle. So angle OBD, cos OB and OA are radius. So this rate angle is equal to this rate angle. Then by uh, concyclic properties, uh, this rate angle is equal to this rate angle over here. And then by symmetry of the reflection, this rate angle is equal to this rate angle over here. So we have proven the first pair of angles to be equal. Now we look at the purple angle. So by the green line being parallel, this purple angle is equal to this purple angle. And by the concyclic property, uh, the, this purple angle is equal to this purple angle. So we have proven that these two angles are also equal. Therefore, the, the blue triangles are similar. Now that the, we have shown that the two triangles are similar, we can write down the ratio uh, that, that this implies. So BO over BD is equal to BP prime over BC. And I'm just going to rearrange it a bit uh, by moving the, the terms across. So I have BO over BP prime equals BD over BC. And actually this shows that another pair of triangles are similar. So take a look at the ratios again, BO over BP prime is equal to BD over BC. So, and at the same time, we saw that this tiny angle here is equal to this tiny angle. So we added to the added the common angle here, we see that this angle at B is equal to the other angle at B. Therefore, we have just shown that BOP prime and BDC are also similar triangles. This is actually the real conclusion we need. So we, we move it up here. And by the exact same argument, uh, on the other, on the on the corresponding uh, other vertices, we can show that COQ prime and CEB are similar. So COQ prime and CEB. And now we have all the ingredients to begin computing and showing this uh, equality over here. So what I'll do is I'll compute ODC minus OEB, which is this green angle minus the blue angle. Now firstly, notice that the rate angles are all equal, so let's do this slowly. So this rate angle is equal to this rate angle because of the parallel green lines. And by concyclic property is equal to this rate angle, by symmetry is equal to this rate angle. Again by concyclic property is equal to this other rate angle, and this rate angle is equal to this rate angle by the parallel green lines. So I can add and subtract the, the rate angles to both terms and now the difference becomes BDC minus CEB. 
and now I can use the similar triangles to trans transfer the angles down. So it might be confusing to look at the diagram, you can always look at the similar triangles. So angle BDC is equal to angle BOP prime, angle CB is equal to angle COQ prime. So this is the green angle here, COP uh, sorry, BOP prime minus COQ prime. And there's this common sliver uh, it intersected by both angles, so you can just directly subtract them from, from both terms. The difference is now BOQ prime minus COP prime. And now I perform a, the reflection uh, where B, BOQ prime basically reflected to COQ and then uh, COP prime reflects to BOP. So now the difference is this green angle COQ minus the blue angle BOP. And lastly, uh, because M is the midpoint, right? So this red angle is equal to the other red angle over here. And so we have the green triangle and blue triangle where the red angles are the same. We are interested in the difference uh, green angle minus blue angle. And sum of triangle angles in the triangle is always equal to 180. So that difference is equal to the, the last blue triangle angle over here minus the last green triangle angle over here. And this is exactly what we needed is OP B minus OQC. So this is uh, the statement that we wanted to prove and we are finally done. So what do you think of this problem is uh, problem four, which means it's supposed to be the simplest problem on day two. It's certainly not as uh, easy as it is, but I, I think China has been well known for their the difficulty of the geometry problems of their Olympiad. So this might not be too surprising for, to you. What do you think? Let, let me know in the comments below. So that's all for this video. Uh, stay tuned for more problems and see you soon.